This is spooky. Are we ready for a spooky game? A game by Tobias Shashte and Martin Gantafo. The mystery of the druids. Somebody's really carefully mown this this hillside, haven't they? You can play golf on that. Spooky. I'm liking the spookiness. Runes. We're at Stonehenge, guys. Place of cultural significance. You can't go up to it these days like these guys are. You certainly can't sacrifice babies on it anymore. You have to um, look at it from a distance. From the A road, I think. Which A road is it? I forget. Lots of chanting. Oh, please don't do anything bad to those children. What are we about to play? <laughs> Jesus. They're, they're, they're quads. Is that four babies all identical? Five of them. Jesus Christ, they're all on fire! What the fuck? This was in the advert, but I've forgotten about it. Oh my god, they're all just ash piles and he's still standing there. Okay, that was a bit much. That was a bit That's much. That's why I say you're a blockhead, Lowry. How could you let such a thing happen? The man was innocent. What do you think the press are going to say about all this? Now get out of here! Get the hell out of my sight! And if I have any more trouble with you, you'll be dishing out parking tickets before long. And that's a promise, Lowry! Fuck off, Lowry. It's my time with Miller now. Oh, and here's my good friend Halligan. Another one of the invaluable detectives of our glorious murder squad. Don't just stand there gaping. Come in. Go on, sarcastically deliver that exposition. Oh, mate. You look rough. I'm glad you could make it. After all, you're a busy man, aren't you? Okay. Now look here, Detective Halligan. I've got used to being surrounded by a bunch of incompetent, half-baked blockheads. But your smart, well-dressed colleague Lowry has just earned himself the golden badge of stupidity. Do we have to be so close on your face right now? <laughs> Straight in. Alligan, okay. we've got a bit of a problem. That didn't look like it was we've his had hand. An innocent man locked up in jail. Oh. Regrettably, he was killed in prison before we could correct our mistake. Unfortunate affair. And now we've got this lunatic killer running around all over London. We have to make sure that at least this oversight is put right. Okay. Your clear up rate so far ought to be sufficient evidence. <laughs> Why no have I not said anything at all in this conversation? Common bicycle theft. But this does happen to be the murder squad. I am the chief of this department. All I have for choice is that blockhead Lowry. You. Oh, that's me! What wonderful okay, eyelashes chief. I have. What do you want me to do? Oh, get braces or something. Sort your teeth out, please. <laughs> okay, right. Guys, this this we're in the game. We can now do the settings. Uh, yeah, just pictures of guns and random people on the wall behind him, and um, he seems to have skewered the cigar straight through his fingers. Um, better voice acting than Blackquake. Yeah, these sound like legit British accents, which is quite nice. Now, how is the um, the sound? 
Oops. I just want the menu. There we go. Here we go. Game settings. Right. Let's take the voice volume up. And let's turn subtitles off. And let's take the music volume down a bit. And the, uh, Why don't they line these up? It's so hard to comparatively see what's going on here. Okay. Well, how's, how's that? Sound levels are pretty good. Voice volume up for sure. Okay, cool. So we'll go with that for now. Yeah, to Tommy Gun. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what year this is. I mean, it was out in like 2001 or something. So it's it's uh, it's not that old, but I don't know if it's set then. It might be from the lack of computers going on here. All right, boss, Jeff. Uh, where did Larry go wrong? Right, we're investigating a crime, I guess. Uh, and somebody was falsely accused. Fishbowl was <laughs> Yeah, and look, he's got four four cups. All to himself. What a waste! An absolute waste. Come on, Jeff, sort Where it out. Where did Lowry go wrong? Your dear colleague Lowry dealt with the skeleton murders last year. You should know that, Halligan. Lowry worked on the case for several months. And finally managed to pull a culprit out of the hat. A butcher from South London. A married okay. man with kids. They gave him a life sentence. He was in jail till three weeks ago. Right. Why did they let him go? Until what do you mean until three what weeks ago? What do you mean ago? until three weeks ago? Did they let him go? In a way. That's what I'm wondering. Yes, they let him go in a coffin. He was stabbed by a fellow inmate. Okay. 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 Predictions now. I reckon Jeff did it. I reckon Jeff is behind the whole thing. You should know that. I <laughs> know. Yeah. You should know that your name is. Oh my god, what's, what's our name? Hannigan? Maybe it's Hannigan? I don't know. Um, uh, stabbed? stabbed. Well, yeah, why was he stabbed? Why? Well, life in prison's hard. I suppose the inmates don't like psychopaths much. Odd, really, considering the whole place is crammed full of them. Whatever. Jeff, you can't say dead. that. By the way, his lawyer that. phoned this morning and told me a hell of a lot of legal stuff. Just after the report. You're a cop! Mayor, you should know legal stuff! I was thinking of suing our department. <laughs> you should give her money. She's lost her husband and the, and the father of her, ch of, of her children. Yes? Yes, that's right. Okay, I did it! You reckon I did it? Okay, well, we should do a. <laughs> we should, let's do a poll. Let's do a poll right now. New poll. Who did it? did it. So it's either me, I think my name is Hannigan, or it's uh, Jeff with a G, or it's Lowry. For the next 10 minutes. There we go. For the next 10 minutes we'll suss this out. And we'll solve it in 10 minutes. We'll be fine. Um, suing our department. Well, we, well, her husband's dead, so we don't need what to report that. on the radio. I don't know what you're talking about. I think it's I live under a rock. News from the skeleton murderer. Unidentified body found in the park. It was broadcast on the 10 o'clock news. Live from the scene of the crime. You should stop reporters being on scenes of crime. Isn't that part of our job to, like, cordon off things? Critical analysis of the game. Oh, yes. Yeah, here we go. There's been another murder. No, they just found, they just found a body. There's no murder, it's just There's a body. There's been another murder. Exactly, Halligan. A pile oh, it's Halligan. Has been found Oops. in Epping Forest. Oh, I love Epping Forest. We don't know any more than that. I presume we both agree that it can't have been Lowry's man, eh? Oh, of course. You he see, could have paid for a hit. He just managed to get that into Lowry's head as well. You heard All right. it. Lowry's off the case. Halligan, Fuck Lowry. you drive out to Epping Forest and take a look it's at the evidence. now. Of course, sir. And Halligan, Sir. no sloppiness now. I want results. Sensible results. The press is already <laughs> It's not going to be sensible, you know morning. it. <laughs> the killer must be found. Do okay. I make myself clear? Of course, Chief. Good. Are you this standing This is the file with all the necessary out? information, and now you better get going quickly. Else what? What are you going to do? Jeff's a bit intense, guys. Can we ask you anything else? Uh, No, I, I don't... I, I don't think we need to ask you anything. Let's leave. Oh, look! Okay, so this is us. Hey, look at me! <laughs> is it Lowry? Uh, <laughs> no, it's Lowry the painter. The acclaimed dead painter. Lowry. We work for them. He's back from the dead. Okay, right. Um, I'd better not. These files are secret. 
Why aren't they in a secure cabinet then? Why are they just on wheelie trays where you can just like take them out of the office? Ah, now this water cooler. I'm not thirsty. I all right, fine. Oh, the Union flag. The Union flag. A Union Jack. It's not a Jack. Only the Scotland Yard bigwigs get to have one of them. <laughs> Do you need a license to have a Union flag? What are you talking about? Oh, let's look at this. These pictures of guns. But <laughs> only from this side, from this end. Anyone could have a sound. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Leisure suit. <laughs> what does that mean? What is Leisure Suit Larry? Okay. Oh, look, we can talk about all these people. This guy. I don't know. Who's that guy? One. Some gangster or other. You should probably know. A confiscated murder weapon. A confiscated murder weapon. A confiscated <laughs> murder weapon. And this A one? Confiscated murder weapon. Wow. Look at this submachine gun. A confiscated murder weapon. A Mac 11. A confiscated murder weapon. <laughs> okay. What is that? A confiscated murder weapon. No, but what is that? <laughs> it looks like an EpiPen. So it's been killing people with an EpiPen. Is it there is? Uh. Oh right, okay. No, I don't know anything about that. Fluffy things like that. Who's I don't this know guy? This one? Some gangster or other. No wonder this guy was so hard on us. I don't know this one. Some gangster. Do you know other. any of these people? I don't know this one. Oh, for God's sake! Some... Right, we're leaving. We're leaving. Chief's shelves are definitely tidier than mine. Okay. Now I, I've loaded this game a couple of times because I had to get the aspect ratio right. At custom drag. This is actually a very zoomed-in display capture. Very complex. Every time I've loaded into the game, I feel like Chief has said something different to me, which is making me a bit nervous as to what kind of game this is going to be. Let's leave. We're going to Epping Forest. Wow. We work at an ice rink! <laughs> Why is this corridor so big? <laughs> oh, okay. And you can just print your confidential files just like right into the atrium. <gasps> can I print something? <laughs> My boss hates me. <laughs> okay. Well, okay. Does he do a different body part? No, it's the same. It's just the right cheek. Okay. All right. <laughs> He's winking, winking, and everything. Okay, let's leave now. Uh, we can't go through that way. That's to the guy's office. Oh, what's this way? Stiffly walk over here. <gasps> New Scotland Yard. Coca-Cola. Official sponsorship for this game. No Coca-Cola. You have no. You're a detective. Why do you have no money? What's in here? Oh. Well, you look at this. You know what? Actually, the graphics of this game, they aren't. They aren't that bad. They aren't that bad. Okay. I've got to make sure I don't like roll off my floor tips. I tend to like roll off to outside the room. Hello, Chaotix. How are you doing? Welcome, you're at the very start of our adventure into this silly, strange point and click game where we're inve investigating a series of murders. Um, okay, at least it was his face, yeah, that's true. Hello, Hello who are Jack. you? Hello, Brent. Brent? We're, well, our name is Brent Halligan. Well, hello, Janet. Uh, nice today, isn't it, Janet? Nice day today, isn't it? Don't trouble yourself, Brent. I will not go to the cinema with you. Oh, but those teeth. Just got, got the hots for those teeth. Um, I've still got your green scarf. No, Janet. That's not what's on my mind at the moment. I've still got your green scarf. You want it back? Oh, that ugly thing that the department gave me as a present for my birthday. I picked it. Well, I was hoping you'd either forget it or throw it away. Just keep it, please. All right, Janet, with your glasses stuck on your face with tape. Um, the chief picked, oh, the chief picked it. To hear that. He picked it for you. Well, maybe, but it suits Take you friend, better maybe. than me, Brent, if you know what I mean. And now I don't feel like talking to you about Excuse this me? nonsense anymore, so I'll see you later. What is your job, Janet? Good. See you later, then. Take your time, Brent. Can you... Can you... <laughs> What is going on? What is going on with you? Okay, we're going to back away from you, Janet. You're a bit scary. Let's go over here. 
What's this? These are secure files. I like this. The files of our department. This is where we keep every single unimportant scrap of paper. We'll have to break through the wall soon to make room for more. All right. That's the Central That's... Crime Prevention Office. It keeps an eye on flashpoints in the center of London. Flash? What on earth is a flashpoint? I live in London. What is a flashpoint? That neck. Her, what? Her neck? She's... She's That's an odd one, is Janet. All right, we know what that is, Brent. Keeps an eye on flashpoints in the center of London. Okay, look at this. Look at this thing here. We need clues. Carbon we need clues. Paper. That's a good clue. Clips. Paper clips. Forms for obtaining materials. Clipboards. <laughs> Clipboards. Okay, your accent, mate. Let's I switch. quite like it. We have four lines, but Janet's all on her own at the moment. That's what happens during the holidays. But what? Oh, it's. Hang on, it's autumn. What holidays are in the autumn? Is it Halloween? Okay. Soft spot for awful old films in this game. But yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, um, if you want a terrible game to play, and actually I would love to see Fluffy play through this, then you should play um, Deadly Premonitions. Amazingly bonkers, stupid game. Right, who's this? Arthur Conan Doyle! There we go. Oh, look, it's my office. I have a bust of Arthur Conan Doyle. That's cool. And I have a big sign over my office. I'm better than that. We can say that much at least. What's over here? In this random drawer. What is that? Oh, j <laughs> okay, just two boxes of Pall Mall's. All right. <laughs> That's fine, I guess. <laughs> um, yeah, Seth, it's uh, uh, yeah, it's it's quite unforgettable. Although I haven't finished uh, watching a playthrough of My it yet. Books. My books. Scotland Yard could fork out some money for an additional shelf. Well, oh, look at this crop circles, open skies, closed minds, all. Darts? You can stop smoking. Yes, you can. Uh, 12 days to stop smoking. These are hefty smoking books. The results of the investigation in my last case. Conclusion? The offender could not be determined. That's not a conclusion then, is it? You just gave this up. This is my collection of case files. I won't describe this it that way. Of, this is my smoking will be the death of me. It will. It really will. Okay, well this was... Can I put my hat on? We need, we're need. we going to Epping Forest. We're going to get cold. Can we put them both on? Who's this? Who's this by the door? It's actually quite a nice photo, I would say. Right, so half of us think it's... Um, what's our name? Halligan? I think I spelled it wrong. Half of us think it's Jeff. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you want the sound commands from this game? I know, they're going to be great, aren't they? Um, deliciously simple recipes like Pal Mal. Yep. Okay. Got. Oh my god, he can run. Just double click run. Wow, look at those legs he has. Nice long legs. Okay, off we go. We should go. How do we leave? We're on the third floor. Let's. Okay, we need to go to Epping Forest because we're never going to solve this crime. In we go. Oh wow, look at this! Look at me, I'm standing on the front of my car. Why is my car from the 50s? And I'm looking at a map. And we're going to Epping Forest. Oh, look. That's not what New Scotland Yard looks like. Is it? I'm pretty sure it looks, like, grey and boring. Okay, it's a great map. Look at all the places. We're going to Stonehenge. Now, where's Stonehenge? It's, like, here? Somewhere here? Right, Epping Forest first, and then Stonehenge. Oh my god, the police are wearing purple. Look at this! Oh, the sound design. Can you guys hear the birds? Let's talk to this constable. When is this set? Look at your hat! Look at your... proportions. Good morning, Hello. officer. Hello. Good morning, officer. detective. Uh, I hope you've had a good breakfast. Because mm, you're at a bath it up. not very appetizing. Okay. Uh... When were the bones discovered? Oh, well, you know, I've got used to it. When were the bones discovered? At 5.30am, by a jogger. He phoned us. 
I don't care that he phoned you. Why would I need to know that? Okay. Uh, a jogger. Has he been interviewed? Has he been interviewed? Well, he's in hospital for the time being. The shock, you know. We could hardly even take down his particulars. Why was oh my that? Gosh. He, well, he had to throw up several times, sir. Oh, I understand. Not on the evidence, I hope. Oh my gosh. We're going to talk to you in a minute, lad, because for me, the music is just a little bit... It's a bit too much for me. Okay, Good morning, continue officer. what you were Good saying. Morning, Good morning! morning. Uh, I, I hope I'm... I have good breakfast. <laughs> breakfast. The site over there is not very... Appetizing. Okay, that's good. Yes. Okay, that's good. Um, forensic squad. That sounds good, doesn't it? Forensics? I know, officer. I can imagine a better site as well. Has the forensic squad already been here? Yes, just this morning, after the phone call. And what... Um, and, and? And? Ah. Are there any useful traces? Hardly any traces at all, sir. No blood, no fingerprints, nothing. I don't want to judge the case yeah, but the bones. surely, but I don't believe you'll find anything more here, sir. Detective Hecker and his people have done a thorough job. We'll see. Who's Detective Hecker? Is it Lowry Hecker? What? No blood. Looks like the murder wasn't committed here, then. No, that's hmm. true. Well done, Hannigan. Blood. Halligan. Looks like the murder wasn't actually Brent. committed here, then. Either that, or somebody cleaned the place up very carefully, yes. Yeah, right. That yeah, would match the recent cases as well, if I may say so, sir. Yeah, alright, mate. Um, you wouldn't be able to... Oh, Jesus, I just noticed what's behind me! I didn't even see that before! Mmm! Thanks for the warning, actually. Uh, okay, officer, I take back the it. sarcasm. Thank you. Any time, sir. No, I wanted to ask him. Brent, we had more questions, didn't we? Did we not? All right, let's go over here. Let's go look at this thing. Ooh! Sorry if you're eating, guys. Ugh! It's floating off the ground. See that? It's hovering. All right, let's investigate. Oh God! Why did we go closer? Um, the skull of the corpse. Ah. There's hardly any flesh on the bone. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. There's hardly any flesh on the bone. Okay. There's hardly any. F this bone is quite long. Ooh. Seems it's from the victim's leg. There's hardly any flesh on the bone. There's hardly any strange. There's hardly the grass. Oh no! What was strange? Is black. Ah, burnt. Strange. There's hardly any. There's hardly. There's hardly. There's hardly. There's hardly any. What is this bone here? Unbelievable. What? Okay. Well, I'm not sure that was very helpful. I don't know how to investigate. How do I investigate in this game? Um. No. Yeah. It's pretty grim, isn't it? How much flesh is there? <laughs> not much. There's hardly any. Okay. Right. What else can we look around for here? Just doing some pixel searching. Don't take a shit on the crime scene, officer. Hang on. I'm pixel I told you, don't do that! Can we go talk to this person? I wonder if it's like Resident Evil. If you walk a certain distance, it'll like... Don't step. I stood on the evidence. Brent, what are you doing? Okay. Uh, come over here quickly. There's nothing here. There's nothing here? Alright, I guess we'll leave. Great. That's it? Hang on a minute. No, wait, hang on a minute. Let's ask this guy another question. Uh, yeah. Sorry, Chaotix. <laughs> if you were eating. Uh, it can't be burned. Yeah, it, it couldn't be burned. I mean, it said the grass was black. The grass did not look black to me. But that's what he said. Uh, the bones would be both scorched and covered in ash. You know when this game is from, Fluffy. <laughs> Officer? Officer? What is it, Officer? Sir? Uh... I get the impression I've lost my wallet! <laughs> what? Um... Help me out. I just help me out you might here. Help me a bit. With criminal investigations? Sorry, sir. I'm only a patrolman. I'll do my job and you do yours. Do you not want to go up in the world, Officer? Do you not want to become a member of our murder squad? Alright. The best ideas often come from the man in the street. What do you mean, sir? I must ask you to show a little more respect. And now let me do my work here. You're 
literally doing fuck all, mate. You can at least have a thing. You you were offering me so many clues a minute ago, and now it, this is a body swap because you're not the same helpful helpful gentleman. What work are you doing? You're just standing here, as you say, sir. Brent, I'm on your okay, side. Okay, that was it. Thank you. Right. Any time, sir. Fuck off, you asshole. Right. Okay. Well, I guess we're leaving then. Is that it? Can we just go to the lab or something? Because that was. Why did we even go there? Why did we go there? In we go. Here I am. Looks like I'm about to do um, gymnastics. I'm like getting ready at the end of the... the. What do they do it on? What do gymnasts do, do, do the thing on? Just like a bit of carpet, isn't it? Okay, right. Let's go this way. Go over this way quickly. Oh, hang on. Is that Lowry's office? Oh! <gasps> We should probably uh, yeah we oh my god he's possessed look at him he did it it was larry guys i've solved it the floor floor routine okay seth i'll trust you on that one that sounds right um larry why why have you been possessed by satan is that an option hello can we larry talk to, oh, we can talk oh, to his knee oh, not you halligan you're all i need at the moment you need no. You need a lot of things right now, <laughs> and admittedly, I'm not one of them. Um, have you got a couple have of minutes? Have you got a couple of minutes, Lowry? I'd like to talk to you about a couple of things concerning the last skeleton murder. I really don't feel like chatting right now. Least of all with you, Halligan. Read the file. It's all in there. I oh, I didn't even know I could read the file. <laughs> okay, Lowry, I'll do that. Um, I didn't see any inquiry results in the information department in your file. I've read, yeah, I've read the Darling, file. I've read your file. There's just nonsense in it. Do you know what I think, Halligan? I think I don't need to tolerate a detective in a 20 pound suit walking past my door criticizing the quality of my work. I actually walked in your door and spending more than 20 pounds on a suit is a waste of money, I would say. Hardly my fault. Yeah, there my we go. My suit was more expensive. <laughs> I like Bren. make your file any better. Very witty, detective. Yes, really, very witty. Tell me, haven't you got anything better to do than crack jokes? No, actually, I don't. I'm kind of lost. Epping Forest was a bit of a dead. Thank you for being so very friendly, Lowry. Enjoy your spell. <laughs> Roll my eyes when I'm really elegant. pissed off. Fuck you, man. And your stupid pictures of Ferraris and shit. Is that a Ferrari? Looks more like a Lamborghini, actually. Red Lamborghini. Right, we should read this case file. I'm going to read it in front of you. Read. Not a good Him idea. read? No? Okay. Think first, Brent. My Think? case file. How do of I read course. it? It can't work like that. Of course! Of course! How do I read it? It would have surprised me if it had worked like that. Hang on. Right. Let's get rid of... Okay, right. Oh, right. Hang on. How is he say I don't know Chaotix. He's possessed. He did it. I reckon he did it. Um, <laughs> the chair I'm stuck up his house. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe. Okay, right. So, left-clicking it picks it up. And then I can't do it on myself. He doesn't want it. And it doesn't go anywhere. So, right-clicking it... My case file. But how do I read My it? My case file. My case file. My case file. <laughs> Brent, how do I read it? There's not. There's no other menus, is there? There's no other secret menu. All right. Can I comment on anything? A fan. <laughs> Those really piss him off. Great. Okay. Yeah, you can cool it, mate. You can chill the hell out. Oh, look at that. Two thousand and. Seven, maybe? 2007. Gosh, this is uh, embarrassing that it's 2007. He's got books? They're probably just for show, meant to impress the ladies. Wow, what a sassy asshole I've got. Um, try his knee. Check the file at his knee. I, yeah, I. He he just says don't, don't do that. So if I take this file and I do it on his. Oh, hang on. I need to. Right, talk. Oh, I can't talk to him. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Right, okay. So, if I take the file, and I there's put it no on him... There's no point in that. There's no point? Why is there no point in hmm. this? 
Nothing's He's the happened. detective. I can't do that. That's futile as well. I thought it wouldn't work like that. Well, tell me how it works! Alright. Alright. See you later, Larry. See you later, Larry. Fuck you. Right, let's go this way. Come this way quicker. Run. Run, man. Okay, can we go in this way? These are the chairs for visitors. Okay. No, we don't want to look at the fresh copy. Can we go in that door? Whose door is that? Ah, yeah. Oh, yes! It's the lab! That's what we need! That's what we need. Okay. Poundland 10th Doctor is being very helpful. <laughs> What? <laughs> you saying that Brent looks like David Tennant? <laughs> I can kind of see it. Okay, right, who's this? Okay, good. Hello, Mate. Chris. Hi, Halligan. Chris, help me! I've just come back from the place where they found the bones in Epping Forest. Mm-hmm. Why are you mm -hmm. telling me? Have there been any decisive discoveries in that case? Uh, can you, like, do a DNA test or something helpful, please? It was just a pile of bones. It was okay. a pile of bones. Nothing else. Yes, I had that impression as well when I was out there with the forensic squad. Everything is quite clean. You didn't but the find bones, anything Chris! Either. No, nothing. I would actually have Chris! been surprised if you had. And why did you come here then, if I may ask? Oh, I thought you might be interested in this. Sure, Halligan. Thank you. Anything else? No, in what? What it. did you give well, him? See you later. Chris, do your job! Okay, Chris. See you later on. Chris! Chris! Hello, Chris. Hi, Halligan. Chris! I've just come back from the place where they found the bones in Epping Forest. Mm-hmm. Why are you telling me? Have there been I want any you to do your job. discoveries in that case? Maybe there will be! I just had a look around there. Oh. Yeah, it's actually quite a nice place, isn't it? It is, actually. I've spent a lot of time there. Yeah, in lockdown. It's a great place to go. Um... Okay. How can you think of a picnic when you're looking at the scene of a crime like that? Why not? The bones, the green meadow, it all somehow reminds me of a picnic, don't you think so as well? Well, we always had yeah, chicken okay. on our picnics, and it looks quite the same after we're finished. Oh my Size god, chicken Hagar, were you I eating? I had your nerve. I was nearly sick out there. Well, you know, Halligan, I'm not squeamish. I've been doing Maybe this job in the lab for too long now to get the shivers anymore. I wouldn't take too long now. you paid me for it. You get used to everything. Okay, Chris, I have to go. Thanks Are you vaguely Scottish, today, Chris? Kevin. I love being informed that nothing has been found out yet. You are... V you are vaguely Scottish. Okay. Fuck you, Hal... Uh, I'm Halligan. Chris? Am I going to have to do my own forensics now? Oh my god, I am. Guys. Guys, here we go. Something is just being distilled there. Something is just being distilled there. Alright. That's the gas hose for the Bunsen burner. It is, but why is it directly over a sink? You don't put a gas hose right over a sink because you might turn it on thinking it's a tap. Who designed this laboratory? Not up to code. A flask. A flask. Okay. What else? This. The back wall. Hmm. A container Ooh. with chemicals. Hmm. A contain Chris is quite a strange guy. What does he like about these pictures? What do you mean? They're, 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 they're shapes of, like, compounds. It's a helpful thing to look Chris at. This is quite a strange... Hmm. A container. I can't do anything oh with this. God. Oh. Oh. A bottle with some sort of chemical. It says propanol on it. You can read! Oh my gosh. Is he a bob? <laughs> Okay. The bottle is full of dust and fingerprints. No, it's ninety percent ethanol, surely. A bottle with some sort of chemical. Too too dangerous to too 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 dangerous. All right. Um. That's a mortar. That's a mortar. That's a mortar. Oh my god! Oh my god! Where are the clues? Test tubes. Stop naming things, guys. How about we give the file to Chris? Hang on, let's, go, let's run, over, run over here. You should never run in a lab. Right. Okay, right. Chris. Chris. Chris! Chris! How do I read, Chris? I haven't learned to read. 
It's not very helpful. Right, we're going to have to hand the case back, guys. I can't solve it. It's hard. It's too hard. We'll just tell. We'll just tell Jeff that um, that we can't do it. Okay. We don't know any more than that. I presume what could somebody tell me more than that? that? Lowry's man, eh? Oh, of course. You I see, don't agree with that. I've just managed to get that into Lowry's head as well. You no, you got that into his head like three hours Lowry's ago. Lowry's off the case. Halligan, right, we know that. You drive out to Epping Forest and I take a look this. at this. Of course, sir. I tried and looking at the evidence. No sloppiness now. I want results. Sensible results. It's all sloppiness. The has already been terrorizing me this morning. A killer must be found. Do I make myself clear? Of course, oh, Chief. Yes. But how do I read? <laughs> Let's save the game. I feel like we've not achieved anything. Why does saving the game not do anything? Save game. Load game. Save game. Load game. No. Oh, God. Right. Come on, Janet. Help us out here. We need help. We don't know what we don't know what we're doing. Janet, will you please look at this case file? Please look at this case file, Janet. 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 Fine. Janet, we'll just talk to you instead. Janet. Hello, Janet. What is Hello, it Janet. Now? I need the phone call of the um the man who rang you this morning because he the the cop specifically said he rang the police. I just forgot a couple of things. What is it? I need the phone call. I need the phone Have call. Have you got a minute? Not even a minute, Brent. Do I look as though I've got any time? You look as though you're doing fuck all. Right. Uh... It's important. <laughs> Can't you stop working for a moment? What do you need? I need information. I need inf I need information. I just want to make a couple of... I, I need information. Need information. Of course, Brent. You need information. And I need the necessary forms. More precisely, assigned 234-2. Now, have you got it? No. Whose signature I need do I need? signature? Whose signature? Oh, my God, Brent. Don't pretend to be more stupid than you are. All right, well, I'll See go get a then. form then. I think time, there's a form Brent. in... Um, Fuck you, Janet. I think there's a form in Jeff's office. We'll go back to Jeff's office and we'll get a form. Um, okay, right. Few items you can take from various rooms. Okay. Okay, right, okay, right. Don't tell me any more, Seth. Right, we need, to pick, we need to pick shit up. So I know that we need to go and get a form from um, the office. From Jeff's office, because I remember seeing a thing and it said, Here are, here's the necessary form. Was it this office? Yes, I think it was over here. I think it, I think it was here. It was a form on here. Chief's shelves at Chief's, Chief, 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 Chief's, Chief's, all our files are stored in there. All our files are stored in there. Right, okay, well, right, let's take, let's take this, take this. Take that. Yoink! Okay, right. Right, now we know we can steal things. Let's start let's start stealing things. Okay, right, what else can we steal the water cooler? I'm not thirsty. Alright, it's fine. Right, so the I forms aren't not. in These here. Files are secret. Maybe the form is in Where was the form? Right, let's go to my office. Let's go to my office and see what we can loot out of there. New Scotland Yard! Here we go! Sir Arthur Conan Doyle. Brent. In we go. Okay, right. Well, let's take some pizza. We need, we need pizza. there's no pizza in there anymore. Pizza? No pizza? Oh my god, we can make phone calls! Oh my god! It doesn't work like that. You don't hear anything, and nothing happens either. My God. Okay. All right. Let's play our messages. Play. Oh, we have no. I'd better leave that here. All right. I let's never use pick the up the phone. That thing is just too heavy. Using the well, loudspeaker they... is much more comfortable. Okay. F. Right. We're gonna press all the buttons. Oh, that's the loudspeaker. Okay. Well, let's call Janet. Hello. 
Didn't work. It's engaged. She's engaged. Pass open to Maria. Okay. I won't right. find anything I could make use of now. I won't find we anything. Need to pick I, I won't find anything I could make. The cleaner will empty the. I won't. I won't. I won't. I won't find anything I could make use Please of now. Please pick there. something up that is useful. We're gonna go back to Janet because of the because maybe the form was in her room that we should fill in. Okay. Oh, an evidence bag. Oh, there's no evidence bag in there. There was no evidence. You show me where the evidence bag is, Seth. It's not there. Not there. Okay, here's the forms. I'll take that with me. You never know. I might need it. Okay, good. It's always handy having one of these tucked away. We ran out okay, not so long good. ago, and there was a big commotion on this floor. Okay, good. At least that's one thing you can get hold of here without too much trouble. They are needed for the forms. Makes it easier for the chief to sign them. Okay, okay, we've looted Janet's office. Oh my god, he like slid. Did you see that? Slid to attention. Run over here quicker. Okay. Interact with it. Interact with it. Interact with it. Inter right. We're going to go see Chief. We're going to get him to sign the form. Can we combine this and this? Looks like that this? won't work. No, that's Why a not? form for stationary procurement. Without that, you don't get anything at Scotland Yard. Oh no, but I want I want the other form. I want a, a Looks different like that form. Won't work. That would be stupid. No, that's a clip. Why would it? That's a clip. It won't work like that. All right. I can't see any connection there. Okay, let's ask him for some stationery. I need stationery. No. No. Can we steal anything from you? So what? Do, what happens if I? Uh, try and give you There's this no back. There's no point in that. All right. That well, what if I? That's a form. For, that's a form for stationary. I don't need a signature for obtaining materials. I need one for obtaining information. But where is the form, Brent? Where is the form? Oh, you can not. find more items in my these office drawers. All right. All right. Wait, these drawers. Let's try these drawers as well. No. Okay. Right. We're going back to our office, guys. We're just zip zapping straight across the foyer for the whole day. Come on, Brent. Hurry up. In your office. Ultimate flow! <laughs> we're doing it. We're doing the flow. Okay, right. We're going to look in the drawers. Oh my god. I even looked in this drawer earlier. Right. Evidence bag. No, no darts now. Maybe I'll Why can't I play darts? Against my favourite opponent, Inspector Miller. No, we're not playing against Leave Jeff. Them. I don't need Leave those them. anymore. Don't need them. Don't need them. You don't want to buy any sticks today. Okay. Right. So, right, now we have an evidence bag. Guys, we're going to Epping. We're going to Epping. You think, like, it's not usually a, a, a detective's job to bag the forensic evidence. Usually the forensics teams comes in and does that for you. But Chris refuses. Absolutely refuses. Right, go on. In we go. Okay, right. Evidence bag. That is no important evidence, I'm sure about that. That's the victim. It's pretty important. All right. We should probably pick up the victim. And not leave them that here. That is no important evidence, I'm sure it's about that. It's the victim. That is no important. That is no. That is no. That is. That is. That is no. That is. That is. That is. That is, that is, that is, that is, that is no important evidence, I'm sure about that. Okay, why is the leg bone more important than the skull? Why don't we take this whole poor bastard with us? That is. I don't understand it. I don't understand it. We're just going to leave him there. We're going to leave him there. Always. Seth, what the hell? <laughs> I expected it to be bad. I didn't expect it quite to be this bad. Okay, where's Chris? Chris is in here. Let's talk to Chris. No, that's Larry's office. Oh, shit. Okay, bye. Right. Uh, right, here we go. Chris is in here. Right. Yes, let's see Chris. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, alright, alright. 
please, Chris. Oh, please, Chris. Right. Chris. Here you go, Chris. Here you go, this. Chris. Bone. Very likely the right thigh bone. Okay, good. Why are you bringing it here? I had a look at the bones with the forensic squad this morning. I know, but I've still got a couple of questions about them. Well, like who it is? Then. Who is it? Okay. Right. Did somebody maybe scorch the flesh off the Did bone? Did somebody maybe scorch the flesh off the bone? No, definitely not. That would look different. I suspect oh my God. That it was rather cut off. Or maybe taken off with acid. Have we ever seen Chris and Fluffy in the same room at the same time? I don't think we have. What, what? sex was the victim? Judging sex. by the structure of the bones, I think it was male. I'll write that down in my report as well. But I'll tell you right Why did now you not? that you won't get it before the end of the week, Halligan. This is a priority case number one, says Jeff. Can you see any, any abnormalities? abnormalities? I would have noticed them, Halligan. No fractures, no bruises. I can see several cut Everything marks quite on normal. it. Quite, quite normal? What is this guy on? I think I found the test tubes. Okay, can't you tell me more, can't Chris? Can't tell me more than that about the bones. Chris, that doesn't help me. There's no, it really doesn't. no more to say about the bones, Halligan. Just wait for my report. You'll have it all nicely written down then. Or, hang on a moment. If you're really interested, go yes. and see Professor Turner. He was the supervisor of a friend's PhD thesis. That's okay. how I met him. He works okay, in the Archaeological Museum in Oxford. If anybody can say anything about the bones, he can. You work for New Scotland Yard! You are meant to be the pinnacle of, of, of forensics! Thanks, Chris. Okay, thanks for the advice. Don't mention it, Brent. This place is filthy. Like, how are you meant to, like, test anything in a, a lab as disgusting as this?